Ladies and gentlemen, it's me, James Finney, coming at you this Thursday morning from the balcony above the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. And I'm feeling good today, Wall Street. It looks like the inflation report has come in better than expected. Markets are positive. Sentiment is positive. Um, the weather outside positive. Everything around me is positive. So hopefully we continue that vibe as we go towards the latter part of the trading week. Let's now take a look to see how the markets are shaping up to close out this, the second to last trading session of the week here on Wall Street. Now, U.S. stocks surging this Thursday morning after October's read of consumer prices raised hopes that inflation has peaked. The Consumer Price Index, a broad measure of goods and services cost, rising just 0.4% for the month and 7.7% from one year ago. Economists were expecting increases of 0.6% and 7.9%. Treasury yields, meanwhile, plunging after the CPI report, with the 10-year Treasury yield falling more than 18 basis points to 3.946%, falling below the key 4% level. And this follows one day of losses with the Dow Jones dropping 646.89 points or 1.95%. And stocks suffering worse in late Wednesday after crypto exchange Binance said it's backing out of plans to acquire its rival FTX. This dragged down the tech sector and pulled Bitcoin's price below its last seen in 2020. And lastly, some advice. If it sounds too good to be true, it's most likely not real.